Y'all, I've been told this is the most powerful lighter that you can carry. And I gotta tell you, I'm pretty inclined to think so myself, but I wouldn't exactly call it a lighter. I'd call it a torch. Check this out. This thing will burn through an aluminum can in no time flat. It will. Do some wood burning. So uh, let's talk about what this thing is and let's take a good look at it. We'll get with it right after this. This particular lighter is the Harrogate, and I'm gonna leave a link in the description, but if you go on Amazon, there are several different manufacturers, and they all look pretty much identical. I'm sure they're all made by the same company. This particular one is the Harrogate. Now, it does come very nicely packaged. It's a nice textured, hard cardboard box, and we'll open it up, and we'll see that it does have a little instruction manual to it. It's got a little QR code where you can scan it with your phone, and it does come with a one-year warranty if you register it. So I would su suggest going ahead and do that. But it comes with a little instruction pam uh, pamphlet. It'll tell you what all the buttons and knobs do, which there's not many. There's just a, a safety switch and a, a up and down valve, and then the filler spout. It'll tell you to relieve the pressure in the bottom before you, uh, before you fill it. Let's go ahead and fill this thing up. All right, so be sure and let all the pressure out. I still hear it hissing. And then we're gonna hit it with a few blasts. Oh, that's cold dripping down. Real cold. I guess it's full. And it says to let it sit for a minute. So we're gonna let it sit for a minute. It is really handsome, but it is really nicely packaged. It, it comes it comes with a, a nice surround in the box and it's just a really good looking device. And, and like I said, for about 20 bucks, man, it's really hard to beat. So let's go ahead and get it down on the table and we can really look at it. Let's go ahead and check this thing out. It is really made of a very nice dark gray aluminum with what looks to be a faux wood paneling. It has a safety switch right at the top of the button to stop you from depressing it. It also has the up and down valve for the, uh, the fire. You can see down here is the fill port where we're gonna fill it. And this thing just feels really well made for how inexpensive it is. You can see there the jet nozzle. You can see on the inside where the fuel comes through and it's very well ventilated to make sure that everything stays cool. And it is just a really good looking lighter. And it throws a very serious flame. So let's go ahead and bring this thing back up top. Mrs. Everyday Man and myself are avid campers. We are always out in the woods somewhere with the camper on the truck doing some camping. And so many times we could have used a lighter like this or a torch like this. What we do generally carry is a Coleman torch that screws onto the large Coleman bottles which is really nice because they will last a really long time, but they're not very portable. And with something like this, you can sip, simply stick it in your pocket and carry it wherever you want. And with the safety latch, you don't have to worry about this thing going off. Now, one of the disadvantages of something like this is just a little bit, I've been playing with it. It's not gonna last very long. You'll be able to light a few fires with it, but, um, it's not gonna last, last nearly as long as let's say the uh, Coleman, right? Cause you've got the big tank. But I will say this thing throws a serious flame, eight or nine inches. And you saw before I put this hole in this can, 
Let's do it again. It really just doesn't take much. This is a serious flame that comes out of this thing and it is really impressive. And I'm gonna have a link down below uh, in the description for this thing on Amazon, but it's only coming in around 20 bucks. And for as attractive as it is, and for the flame that it puts out, I would say that's pretty hard to beat. Now, aluminum can's easy to burn. This is a four by four, a solid four by four. You can see I've been playing with it, but we're gonna do it again. This thing will really burn some wood. Now, in the instructions, it does say not to burn it for more than like 15 seconds at a time. Um, it does have a very small fuel tank that's under pressure, but you can see I just burned those two and it is ready to go again. It will last for a little while. It will certainly light up some fires. But guys, this thing, man, if you need a torch, now, definitely don't, point it towards your bird when you're doing this. But if you need a torch that you can carry in your pocket, I really cannot see anything wrong with going spend $20 on something like this. And uh, now I wouldn't go around lighting my cigarettes with this. I mean, obviously it's doable, but uh, I don't know if I want an eight inch flame that close to my face. But it does, it does go down. You can put it down to where it's, I won't even light to where it's quite reasonable. And maybe you could use it to light a cigarette. It will certainly be windproof, but uh, I would guarantee you, I would only use this thing for lighting campfires or barbecue pits. But I'm gonna tell you, it is certainly worth looking into. Guys, give me a thumbs up on the video. Subscribe to the channel. I'm always doing some kind of reviews and hopefully you can find one that you enjoy. And until next time, I'll see you on Everyday Man.